Kingston Ford's sensational knockout. That's, that's, that's how you want to fuck the world title. How about yeah. that? Um, I had him down. Right. He just wasn't busy enough in a lot of those rounds. He let Akhmadov get off uh, too much. Um, but uh, it was, yeah, it was, it, I mean, that's, that's how you do it. We kept saying on air during the call with, with Christina Poncho and myself, you just felt like the momentum was shifting in the middle rounds. Ford was coming on. He was feeling more confident. He was saving up. He would, he would walk his man down for the first two minutes, but he let him work too much, and in the last minute he'd really come on, which makes it very difficult to score for him. You're losing two minutes of the round. You're hoping that a few big shots in the last minute are going to get you the round, but a lot of them didn't on two of the judges' scorecard did. Nice. So, um, but you did, you did feel there was a momentum shift with the conditioning. I said early on the fight was going to come down to conditioning and that I believe Ray, Raymond Ford had the better conditioning, the better gas tank. He's come on late in fights before. Yeah. Um, and I, I saw homeboy breathing heavy right. at like the third round because he knows everything big okay. but he had multiple gas tanks i was super impressed um i mean just great fight back you know with both of them they, they, they both dug really deep that's what a world title fight should be